Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys had a fabulous week. Today's video we are going to be speed cleaning the house and I'm just kind of doing the master bedroom, the kitchen, the living room and then I'm going to declutter my junk drawers in the kitchen because they were in desperate need of it and I ended up getting some things from the Dollar Tree in order to do this and make it super cheap and be able to organize on a budget. This video is a lot shorter than my normal cleaning videos, but I've got lots of cleaning motivation for you, so I hope you guys will enjoy it and clean along with me. If you are new to my channel, then I would love for you guys to say hey in the comments and let me know where you're from. And if you're a returning subscriber, then I want you guys to tell me what you are cleaning today. Then don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, and if you are new, I would love for you to subscribe and stick around and check out some more of my videos. So as you can see, I started in my master bedroom and this is where I start most days and it just depends on the day, but this is a school day. So I usually don't make my bed until I get back from dropping the kids off. If it's on the weekend, I usually make my bed as soon as we get out of the bed. And here I'm just showing you guys this love letter that I found. I wrote it to Chance when we had been dating for two months. It was dated May 25th, 2005, and I was cracking up reading it. It was just so funny. And if you're new to my channel, meet Cooper. This is my chocolate lab, and everywhere I go, he will follow. So he's just going to nap pretty much all day. <laughs> And y'all let me know if your kids do this too, but mine have been building forts with our blanket every day. So I had to go on the search for this blanket. They also have a new game that they've been playing called Hide the Blanket, where one of them goes and hides it and the other has to go find it. So today I guess I was the one that was going to find the blanket. All right, and now that my bedroom is tidied up, I'm gonna run into the living room and tidy up in here really quickly. I have this basket right here that we take up at night and I just throw the kids pajamas, any toys or anything that needs to go upstairs into this basket and then we'll just take it upstairs at nighttime. So it just makes it easy to get all the clutter out of here during the day. You know it still hurts a little bit, but not that much. Cause if you want somebody else, who am I to judge? I've been thinking about you all the time, but that's all right. I'm starting to get used to it, think I'll survive I met you in the summer When you left it was cold Said we loved one another Guess that we were wrong Now we're moving on to the kitchen and I don't have a ton to do in here either. I do need to pick up the clutter and put everything up, load the dishwasher from breakfast this morning and I'm gonna wash any dishes that need to be washed by hand but the countertops were actually clean last night and I really didn't have to do a lot there. So I'm not gonna mess with that, but then I'll clean up our breakfast area. So if you are the type of person that really loves longer cleaning videos, I did a, it's almost a 45 minute cleaning video that I shared last week and it was a whole house clean with me. So if you're looking for some extreme cleaning motivation, definitely check out that video when you get done watching this one and you'll kind of get to see what my whole house looks like, how I clean around my entire house and I did do a little bit of deep cleaning as well.
right, now I'm moving on to the breakfast area and I'm gonna just put up their homework and things that needed to go up as well as clean off this table because I needed to wipe it down. They had breakfast here this morning and there were definitely crumbs and things like that. But I'm gonna wipe it down. I'm using the Mrs. Myers Multi-Surface Spray and the Honeysuckle Scent. And if you guys didn't see my last video, again, I shared a Grove Collaborative haul in that video as well. So I share a lot of my favorite cleaning products. If you're wondering what types of products I like to use around the house, then definitely check that video out. But I'm gonna just do a quick clean up here. And then I'm gonna vacuum the breakfast area and the kitchen because I did not get to do this the night before. Usually I do try to do a quick vacuum at night, but I did not do that last night, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. Okay, so this was a little bit later in the day. I'd already picked up the kids from school, but I'm showing you guys my junk drawer, and it is an absolute disaster. I have been putting this off for so long. I knew I wanted to film it, but it just, I don't know why. I just kept putting this off. So we have actually two junk drawers in our kitchen. So I'm gonna be cleaning these both out, and I'm gonna use some of our Dollar Tree drawer organizers that I picked up the other day. A few of them have little rubber grips on the bottom. They are perfect for this type of thing. And then the other ones, I actually got a set from Walmart. It was an or drawer organization set that I got from Walmart and I gotten that before I went to the Dollar Tree. So I'm gonna show you guys some of those things. I'll show you what the drawers look like after I'm done. And as you can see, I have my little helper here. He was going through and was like, this is mine, this is mine, this is mine. I was like, okay, well good, go put it where it belongs then, <laughs> not in this junk drawer. And then I also told him that if he would get all this money, all this change up, he could go put it in his spin jar. So yeah, after I ended up pulling everything out, I just started going through and I put, I cleaned the drawer out first. So you can see that here. And then I used my drawer organizers. I put them all in there however I wanted them. And then I started going through everything. And if I didn't want it, I threw it in a little trash bag. If I was going to keep it, I organized it so that it made sense in this drawer. And also another thing that you're about to see is all the neighborhood kids were over this day. So they all started coming over after I started filming this. And I was like, you know what? They're fun. They can run in and out of the house. It was not a big deal. But so you might see them coming and running by in just a minute. So this is how our drawers turned out and I absolutely love it. It was so much better. So as you can see, I have these little 
Dollar Tree storage containers or whatever you call them, drawer organizers, and they have the little rubber grips on the bottom so they won't slide around. And I have all of the things separated that we need in this drawer for easy access. So we have the two little tubs in the front, have like chapstick and then some um, hair ties. And I actually get most of her hair ties from the Dollar Tree as well. But this is perfect because I do her, I do Gracie June's hair downstairs in the mornings. And I have a little sticky notepad. And then I have my pen drawer. This has pens, pencils, Sharpies some juicy fruit and Chance's little coach whistle, some things for Chance, and then that top left is gift cards, and then I have Vaseline there. Then we have a bunch of keys and things, and then that little envelope is for our babysitter money for our Bible study group, and then I also have some notepads that it's under, underneath that envelope. And then the bottom drawer, I didn't show you guys me actually cleaning it out, but I did do it was horrible you saw the before but this is the after I love it it's so perfect we have all of our tablets and things down here as well as chargers our armbands for running with our iPhones um, my headbands and and then more phone chargers headphones tissue all that kind of stuff is down in this drawer so it's super easy for us to just put the iPads and everything up and then if we need tissue we can pull these out and put them in the kids backpacks or my book bag that I like to take with us to sports and all that kind of stuff. Alright guys so that is it for this cleaning video. I hope you guys got some extreme cleaning motivation from this video and that you enjoyed it. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Don't forget to say hey in the comments. Give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next video. Love y'all. Bye.